In this beautiful day, with our ear-to-ear -ear smile, let's learn something new. Look here. My dear learners, he is Dabu. Like every day, today also. After playing with his friends, he is getting back to his home at the exact time. And inside his home, as usual. And this particular time, in the kitchen, dishes are being prepared for dinner. And you know, before entering his home, Dabu smells and tells the dish being prepared in the kitchen. How does Dabu tell accurately about the dish being prepared in the kitchen? Think, think. Yes, right, listen. Dabu's sense of smell is very strong. How is your sense of smell? Do find and share with your friends and siblings. Now, look here. Yes, ears, nose, eyes, tongue and skin. Absolutely correct. From ears we can hear, from nose we can smell, from eyes we can see, from tongue so we these can five taste. are our sense organs from skin do these can five sense organs work same in all of us let's find from your environmental studies book chapter named sharing our feelings my little learner see here yes here we have Seema who is living with her parents maternal grandmother and Ravi Bhaiya she is Seema's maternal grandmother who is hard of hearing and has very low vision also. But she has two interests. One is to know the events going around in the world and the other one is to chop the vegetables. Her one interest out of two that is to know the current events is fulfilled by Seema's father by reading the newspaper aloud to her. And the second interest of cutting the veggies is being experienced by herself. Yes, she does not cut the vegetables in a zigzag way. She is excelled in cutting the vegetables. When someone asked Seema's grandmother, how could she cut the veggies so accurately and nicely? What had the grandmother shared in answer? Think, think. Now look here. Let's meet Seema's Ravi Bhaiya. Ravi Bhaiya loves to listen to music, take part in plays, roam around with friends, talking with people around and reading books. Ravi Bhaiya cannot see but he can catch the sound of footsteps of the people he is living with and tell from the sound of footsteps who is around him. Yes, Ravi Bhaiya shared that his sense of hearing is very strong and he uses his ears for the work that is otherwise done by the eyes. And Seema does tell that Ravi Bhaiya always do his work on his own and without stumbling he roams in the home. Yes. He places his things at the right place. Absolutely. Many people who can see stumbles a lot while walking. Why? Here we have the answer. That the people who can see use their wrist of the sense organs a little. On the other hand, Ravi Bhaiya does not stumble. Why? Hmm. Ravi Bhaiya shares the field with his rest of the sense organs. My dear learners, Ravi Bhaiya also takes a lot of interest in reading and he reads special types of books which are based on braille script. And from where does this braille script come? Let's know. This picture is of Louis Braille. Yes, my dear learners, Louis Braille belonged to France. One day, when he was three years old, he was playing with his father's tools. Suddenly, a pointed tool hurt his eyes. 
he lost his eyesight he had keen interest in studies he did not give up he kept thinking of different ways to read and write finally he found a way reading by touching and feeling this way of reading later came to be known as braille script in this type of a script a row of raised dots are made on a thick paper because these dots are raised they can be read by running the fingers on them this script is based on six points the braille script has undergone many changes these days this has made reading and writing simpler braille can now also be written using the computer so this is how ravi bhaiya reads aptly said my little learners ravi bhaiya listens to many stories from books because nowadays we have audio books too you know children ravi bhaiya when goes out of his home he takes this white stick with him so that he can sense with the stick and walk without any tripling hazards and yes the people around too get to know that ravi bhaiya is visually impaired my dear learners you know government enabled many facilities for people like ravi bhaiya for instance special tiles are installed on footpath so that they identify where to walk straight where to turn where to step on stairs and in buses conductors help where necessary and special seats are reserved for them too children it is always good to try the things out to know them better so here imagine that you are blindfolded i tell you to identify something which is hard but without touching and testing with the help of which sense organ would you identify come on tell me yes absolutely nose with the help of nose you would smell and tell very good what is smooth what is rough yes yes you are blindfolded which sense organ would you use to tell me what is rough and what is smooth yes skin that tells us by touch very good now you have something cold without touching and smelling tell me which sense organ would you use to identify yes tongue very good absolutely tongue tells us by tasting very good my little learners so did you see if your one or the other sense organ does not work still you are able to share your feelings with the rest of the sense organs so this beautiful world is for one and all so keep sharing your feelings stay always happy and healthy bye bye